Let's take a look at calculating the volume or the area of an object in Blender. Alright guys, how's it going? I hope you're doing very well. Now this is a very quick tutorial, in fact one could consider it as a mini add-on review. Now this actually stems from a question on YouTube, the user wanted me to implement the ability to calculate the volume or the area of an object in Haggis tools, but there's already an add-on that does this very well. And it actually comes in built with Blender and it's called the 3D print tool. Now, all you need to do is go to edit, go to preferences, add-ons, and you can see here you can enable it. And it's actually by Campbell Barton, who's pretty well known in the developer scene. So once that's installed, you have several options. And two of these are calculate the volume of an object. So you can see here it gives you the results or calculate the area of an object. So the area is 24 meters squared. So it's a very nice tool, it's very handy and actually has a lot of really nice options, especially if you're doing 3D printing. You can check the integrity of the mesh, stuff like this. You can also do a little bit of cleanup and you also have access to the export options down here. So you can export out as an STL or whatever. Great little tool, especially if you're doing 3D printing. Now, there is an alternative way to actually calculate the area of a face. So let's say we could jump into edit mode, we select a polygon. We can go to the overlay options and you can see here face area and once we enable this it'll actually tell you the area of the face selected so this is four meters squared obviously two by two so that is pretty much how you can quickly calculate the volume or the area of an object do me a favor guys if you find these tutorials useful like the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already follow me on twitter buy haggis tools <laughs> you know what to do take care